Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! We just got back from church. We just got back from church and I just got a package from Venus. Let me show you. I ordered four things and I'm about to try these on. I'm not trying them on for the camera. I'm just, I'll just show you what I got. And then, uh, then we'll catch up. So actually there's two things that I want to talk about that I got. Cause my closet is a mess. So I ordered these things. I've had them for about a week or two and I have not, uh, try them out yet but this is supposed to save some space the lighting is better this is supposed to save some space in the closet so i'm guessing i put let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine slots for hangers which you know i mean i may double up on some of them and then you turn them sideways and it lessens the space so i need to because i got stuff hanging on the poles and everything else because everything can't fit but i bought three of these so we will see if that helps me out but let me show you guys my cute things Again, one is on back order, but let me show you the other stuff that I got. Let me sit you here for a second. So these are the jeans. I'm going to try them on. Usually when I order jeans from Venus, they don't fit my waist good, but they're really good quality jeans. They're supposed to be stretchy too. But they're a little stretchy. But look at these. Wait, let me see. Let me wiggle it. You got to see the outfit that I, I'm putting together. I just bought new boots too. Hey Lex, come check my ripped jeans out. Alright, look. My ripped jeans. I'm going to try them on and see how they look. I might let you guys see how it look. I might. And then I thought this sweater was cute. So I got this sweater off. Got this on the side. On the side. I could have wore this to church today. My package was sitting on the porch. <laughs> nah, maybe next week. Anyway, it's just like a little turtleneck, but it's kind of fitted a little bit. We'll see how it looks. I got to try it on to make sure. I think I got a small. Can I get a small? Uh, let's see. Yes, I always get small shirts. Because that's what I fit. And then this, is this the, oh, I thought I got, oh, this is not, I thought I got a, um, cardigan thingamajigger. Mock neck rib sweater, fold belt over sweater, and then a rib skinny jeans. Okay. I remember this sweater though. It's super cute. And then the one thing that's not coming yet, which is a half zip sweater. I wonder if the half is that? I forgot what it looks like. I wonder if that's what, uh, oh, no, I, I ordered and I already got, I already got the other thing that I'm talking about. It's right here. I haven't even wore it yet. In this mess of a thing. This is why I got those. Yeah, never mind. I already got what I thought. I ordered this too from Venus like two weeks ago. And, uh, it's like, it's a, like a cardigan, but a long one. I haven't wore it yet. It's still broke. Just upside down. Still brand new. But I will be wearing that soon too. Okay. Clear up. Okay. So. Let me open this. You know what? Lex, I might just try these on so they can see how I look in this. Look at my fuzzy sweater. Okay. I thought this thing was so cute on there. And this little fuzzy belt comes with it. So I am going to try this stuff on. I'm going to try it on right now. I'm going to try it on right now. Outfit number. Is that recording? One. So outfit number one, guys. Look at this. The boots came from Venus too. I got them when I got that last cardigan. Look at this. Super cute. I'm not going to tell you about the trouble I had putting the sweater on. And neither is Lexi. What happens in this room stays in this room. But, um. Isn't this super cute? And guys, it fits my waist. The pants fit my waist. These boots are super cute. My first pair of non-black thigh-high boots. I think you, know, you can scrunch them down if you want to. I'm not. I'm just doing it so you guys can see the pants with the. Uh... Woohoo! Look at that. Fits my waist good. 
This is so cute. Wait, the shoulder's right. Okay, super soft. All right, so I'm gonna throw the shirt on, the other shirt on. I'm gonna keep the boots in the pants, and I'm gonna throw the other shirt on so you guys can see that butt. This is a super cute outfit. All right, this is number two, just a shirt though, guys, this sweater. Super cute, right? Super cute. And this is an outfit, like these same pants with the boots and the shirt. That is, that's another outfit that I could wear. Although I got other jeans that I could wear, but these jeans are brand new and I'm loving them. I'm loving them. They actually fit my waist, so I really like them. All right, last article of clothing. All right, so this, guys, I would not, I don't think I would, it doesn't look bad, but I would wear this with, like, a um, a t-shirt, a long sleeve t-shirt, or uh, some other kind of shirt. I would not wear this with a sweater, but I don't have an outfit yet precisely put together for this, but this is the cardigan. Isn't that cute? And then if you got a belt, you can, like, put a belt on with it, um, or you can just leave it like this. It's the back. So all of these came from Venus. I've been shopping in Venus since before my daughter was born. And I just love Venus's clothes. So they always have really cute stuff. All right, well, that was fun. So today is Halloween and my baby just filled up the bucket of candy that I got. Man, those shelves were empty when I went to get that candy. I know it was last minute, but I forgot about it until last night. And when I went, there were no assorted bags of candy. But at least they had those smaller bags, two for seven dollars. But um, it was just the shelves were empty. So let me show you guys my our moms. Of course, you know my husband is the decorator. He really gets into like decorating for the fall season. He loves it, so he always goes and gets the corn stalks, and he gets moms. And this year, they were out of moms except for these white ones, which he has expressed that he is very glad that they were out of the other ones because these white ones have turned out to bloom so beautifully look at these moms and he is just in love with them so he's always talking about them um but yeah so our little spongebob in the window for since the kids were little our burning bush is starting to turn red which makes me sad because I don't mind fall. Oh, let me show you a pumpkin Lexi carved. She carved one of them. Her little friend is supposed to come over today. A little friend. These are teenagers, but her friend is supposed to come over today and they're probably going to carve some of these other ones that are on the porch and uh, hang out for a little bit. <sighs> the wreath that grabs my hair every time I step out of the house. So, and guys, I do have, I'm not, I can't share the news yet because I got to wait to see how things turn out. But I have some news that I want to share with you guys. Hopefully. Okay, so if it turns out good, I'll share it. If it turns out to be a nothing burger, then I won't share it. Because there's no point in me sharing a nothing burger. Well, maybe I will share it. I don't know. But anyway, stay tuned. Future vlogs. Another thing, guys, is I... You know, I just bought the new computer. And... I'm just... I've been having issues with it. The space has been filling up when I try to vlog. It's been taking hours and hours to upload videos. So if you guys are wondering why I haven't been posting as frequently as I normally do, that's why. Because literally it takes like two days to get a video edited and uploaded. And my computer keeps running out of space. I've had it cleaned out. I bought a hard drive external. Um... I think it's like a five terabyte hard drive and, and that that's full. Like, I don't understand what's going on. I never had issues like this with the last computer. You know, it's all these upgrades and updates, but I got a new computer thinking that that will fix the problem. And that filled up and it's just, I'm getting frustrated with it. I don't know. So I'm sorry. That's why I have not been uploading as frequently as I normally do. I'm trying to figure this out, but I'm still uploading. So. I will get this this video done. Hopefully, I can figure out. Hopefully, I can figure it out. It's frustrating, though, guys. It's frustrating to take. Literally, I have to leave the computer up open overnight to get the videos uploaded, and then make them live when I get home from work. And it's very time consuming, and it, it's never used to take this long to do it. And I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing now that's not right i mean maybe i was supposed to change something i don't know but 
that being said, also tomorrow, I start my new work hour. So you guys know I've been seven to noon for the last two and a half years since I've been in endoscopy. So I uh, apply and I've been waiting a few months and I, it's, I'm finally going to start my new hours tomorrow. Um, so instead of working five days a week, I'm gonna be working four days a week, but I'll be working more hours. I'll be working a full shift, seven to 3.30 or 6.30 to, to three. Um, so sometimes they put, put me on a schedule to come in earlier, like tomorrow, my first day of my new hours, she got me coming in at 6.30 instead of seven. But um, four days a week instead of five days a week. So that's going to free up an extra day to be able to do things. I'm also having, I gotta figure out how I wanna do my workout routine because I was working out five days a week. I'm not gonna be able to do that with these new hours because I'm at work all, every day until 3.30. My husband has to go to work, I have to come home, I have to cook dinner, and I won't be getting to the gym every day until like six, or going to the gym and them not being here so I'll never see them, or have food ready, and I just gotta figure it out. So needless to say, I can't continue to do five days a week with this shift, because I'll, I'll just, I'd be gone all the time and there would never be food here. And uh, and I would never see them, more importantly, than the food. I would never, I would see my kid, but I wouldn't see my husband, because he'd be at work all the time. There's my kid back there. Hello, kid of mine. Ooh. I look like a ghost in this Ooh, camera. It's Halloween and my child is a ghost. Why do I look that? Shut up, Alexa. You do that all the time. You look fine. Anyway, are you, are you going to put your vessel on today or no? Mm -hmm. Everything I've asked for today has been... I've gotten no straight answer that is child today. <sighs> anyway. Um... So that's kind of the update, guys. It's kind of the update, what's going on. I mean, I'm not doing anything special. Really, I'm just gonna be here handing out candy. I'm not putting on a costume or anything. Her friend is gonna come. I'm gonna plan to put them to work and they can hand, out, hand out the candy. Mm -mm. Yeah, you hand out the candy every year anyway. So Sometimes, not every time. Yes, you do. She's gonna be handing out the candy. Some of the candy. Yeah, whatever. Because I'm cool. And then, are you gonna do pumpkins? It is something to do. Pumpkins, you're gonna finish the movie. I should make cookies. You have to, I did buy cookies. No, not those cookies. I made cookies. Oh. Yeah, they're like the the the, 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 Have him help you bake the cookies? He loves cookies. Yeah, but does he like baking cookies? I don't know. Right. <laughs> Put them to work. But anyway. Those cookies that have like the cinnamon on them, not chocolate chip cookies. The cinnamon. Da, da, da. The snickerdoodles. It's a little different. But the recipe is on my phone. So you can do that today. Okay. After we're done with some housework. I so. just, I just, I have a candle lit in my room. I just shampooed the carpets. <clears throat> but I have a candle lit and it's one of those candles that go, that have like the popping crackling. wood, the crackling wood sound. And I was up there, I was like. She is her father's child. Yeah. Like, isn't this house nice? I'm like, yeah, the house is mm -hmm. nice, but I, I like like more modern on this house, it's like the inside looks like This is poblano soup with lime crema, which is sour cream with lime in it. This will be done in about 10 minutes. We'll top it with the cilantro and some Monterey Jack cheese and bonnet And you know what? I am really hungry, so I cannot wait to dig into this. It's stitchy. It's a gussy stitch. It's a gussy stitch. Say hello, dear. Hello. <laughs> Wait, nub. There's a nub. Let's go potty. Ring the bells. Ring. Ring them, Gus. Come here. Come here. Ring the bells, Bubby. Come here. Ring. 
Who the hell? He's excited to see you. Look at Hey, ring yes. him. Ring him, Gus. Ring him. He wants you to pet him. Hey, Bubby. All right, I'll give you a pet. There. Bubby. Pat a pet, pet. Pat a pet, 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 pet. Pat a pet, pet. Gus, ring the bells so that you can go outside. He, he doesn't want to go outside. He hasn't peed in a while. You want to go potty? You got to go ring the bells. Ring them. Gus. Gus. Ring them. Ring the bells. Ring them. Hey. Um, ring them. Ring them. Gus, ring the bells. Gus. Ring them. All right, he's being hard with it right Come now. <laughs> little stinker. Okay, he does know how to ring the bells. He rings the bells every day. Didn't want to ring the bells today, though, huh? He was just excited. <laughs> <sighs> All right, guys. Well, I think I'm going to end our vlog here. I hope y'all have you know, are having a wonderful Halloween. Trick or treaters, you know what to do. Give it a thumbs up, subscribe below, hit the bell for notifications, share this video, tell everybody you know, and I'll see y'all in the next video.